Hi, welcome to the new video. Um, today I'm doing the second variation of the uh, Ultimate Skulls, the Orc Skulls. So I laid down the white already. I'm working with black and white as opaque. And um, later I'm using a transparent blue for the background. Let's start with the skulls. I painted the white already. So now I'm using the opaque black for the uh, second step. So the white with the first. Now I'm using a dark gray. So making the eyes, the nose and part of the jaw darker and the rest with a middle tone grey. Now I'm using, um, I'm bending the air hose so, so nearly no air comes through and uh, with re this reduced air I can do these little drops and spots and that gives a texture to the skull. And I'm using this in the stencil, so the texture is only in these small areas. And I've done this also with the white in the background. So now comes the final white. So I have uh, black, dark grey, light grey and white. And uh, the video before this you can see how I do the uh, different uh, scouts in color. So now I'm just doing the full white there. And there you have the first uh, skull. Under three minutes for this. So now I'm using the cover stencil and I'm doing the second skull. Again, black, dark grey, light grey, white. Now comes the dark grey. Again, mm, the eye socket, the nose and the jaws. I do a little bit darker, then with low air pressure I'm doing the little uh, dots and spots for the texture. And the same I'm doing with the light grey. And I'm finishing this with the white. So I have to say this um, because I, I can do two skulls in under five minutes. Is everything is in real time here, so no fast forward. And now I'm doing some prehand on the uh, fangs. And it's finished. Doing some drops for the texture. I'm doing a shadow for the 
because the uh, first skull overlaps the second. And now I'm um, putting the cover stencil on and I'm doing a quick background. That's from a previous video of the, uh, it's called Diabolo. And I'm using this as a background pattern. So it's, it's done very fast and there's some structure there that looks cool. And this is the second part of the stencil, so first was grey, then now comes white highlight. And then you have like a really cool high detail background. Repeat it on the other side. So, and um, I don't want to be too prominent, so I, I'm using a color of this. Normally you can like, uh, like uh, put a color on this and then you can repeat the step with the highlight white. But now I'm just using some blue. And on the um, right side, you can see the bike. So I used like a light brown for the skulls, <coughs> and then um, I used like a green and blue for the background. Now I'm doing some highlights. And then that's it. So if you if you want, you can use like some grunge um, details. But otherwise, it's finished. If you like it, you can subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell for new videos and give a thumbs up if you like it.